Hello everyone, welcome to a new episode of the Mining the World. To be able to have the huge time lapses and mining sessions that I do, I also need to have a strong base of support. So uh, here we are on the base that we are using so far to mine the all over there. And what we need to do today is extend the storage by adding one extra floor because in terms of stone, I only have one or two rows of chests left there, so uh, we need a new floor. Then uh, we need to speak a little bit about the furnace and yours. Uh, but first things first, let's, let's take care of the floor. There we go, the next row of stone is ready to start to be filled. Now, time to tackle the second problem. We actually, uh, s should not call it a problem, because it's not really a problem, but if you look at this chest, I have all of this copper, and all of this copper, and all of this copper, and this is just the tip of the iceberg, because from the huge mountain of force some episodes ago, I still have all of these and all of these, and this is running at full speed. Um, this is a problem. It's taking a way longer to actually take care of the smelting than what I would hope for, and the, this farm, although it is productive, it cannot support everything. And my idea is to actually improve this system. How can I improve this system? I, I, I'm just going to make it bigger. <laughs> I'm going to add uh, three more blasted furnace on the back of these, and I am actually going to expand that to instead of having nine rows, having 18 rows. I I do think this is going to allow us to take care of the problem faster, at least that's my hope, but uh, let's see, let's see. Let's start by the easy one, uh, it would be definitely the lava farm, we just need to add a couple more cauldrons, uh, so uh, these rows and another row, it's, uh, it's very easy to do these farms, so this one should not represent a problem. Uh, now, I do need to actually place the border a little bit bigger, also not a problem. We also expand the glass a little bit more and we do the same thing for the border and actually let's uh, make my life simpler. Now, we need to remove these and we need to add lava, a lot of lava. I cannot forget to add lava to every single block so we add to those three then it is on the middle one on that one then should be on that one and finally i just need to have on this one and on this one yes it's not flowing anymore so that's all uh, now we need to do these we then do this and that so the iron golems do not spawn there we remove the copper and we just need to go and pick some more dripstone and that's it lava farm has now double the capacity and there we go final touch for the lava farm it's ready now it should producing at any moment i mean it's already producing <laughs> that's great now uh, the other part uh, of the smelting is the actual smelting. So, three more blast furnaces, uh, three more hoppers, and three more chests. There we go. Now, um, the trapdoors that have been used in the other way, it can be used on here and this way, and I am missing one. Um, not a problem. It's, it's okay. I, I just need to go and get one more. Uh, these actually go here now. You come here and you come here. And uh, yeah, that's great. Okay, what we now need to do is to start distributing the lava. So we place it here, here and here. And actually allow me to pick a piece of these, some pieces at least. And we do the same thing on this side. And as soon as we now start placing copper on these chests, it should start actually smelting everything. And now I can distribute a way more ores by much more chests, by much more furnaces, and we should go much faster. 
I will do the distribution of camera, it doesn't really matter, but um, yeah, we now have a much better way to smelt yours, we now have a better farm to support it, and now we have another row for our supplies. And that's it, those are the improvements for this week on the base, I really hope that you are enjoying the series, I really hope that you are enjoying everything that we do here, and uh, yeah, I also hope to see you on the next one.